friends, it's coffee time. What are you guys doing? I'm gonna stay like this in case they, they've been wrestling like right around in here for the last few minutes. So maybe we can see some cat wrestles. <laughs> I've got the tender glow of my monitors on me. Every now and then, depending on what tab is up, when I set up the camera, my face will be completely blue or completely red, and I'm like, oh, that's a good look for me. <laughs> so sometimes I have to strategically choose tabs that I already have open. Oh, there it is. See their tails? This fight isn't over. Oh man, this is such an exciting battle. <laughs> man, it was so intense. A minute ago they were like doing flips and whatnot. They were rolling around, it was great. And now Watson is on the defensive. She's under the futon, which is not a good sign for her. But to be fair, Sherlock's like twice her size, so <laughs> it's hard. It's hard to win in those sort of situations with those odds. By the way, spinning to this side. You see that stuff back there? All this stuff? It was sent to me by, um, there's an artist on Tumblr named K009. Love, love all the little comics and everything. Um, I've been following for a really long time. And, uh, got some little, a little art package. With a shirt that says your favorite anime sucks. And then a little Adventure Time, like, baggy. I can't decide if I want to put, like, little makeup stuffs in there, or like pens, or both, and then there's a bunch of little pins, it's so cute, it's so cute, it was amazing, I love it. Oh, now they're, now they're over here. Why can't you guys fight where people can see you? Did I cover it up? Did I ruin it? I'm the worst. <laughs> I get it, get it, I'm the worst, okay? Currently, Sam is upstairs. I was like, I gotta do manga pod and stuff, so, you know, maybe don't be making, like, controller clicking noises the entire time because he's playing Destiny, and he was like, I know what I'll do. He took his entire, like, everything upstairs, <laughs> so he's currently in the bedroom with, like, the PS4 and everything set up and just, like, frantically playing Destiny, so I was like, alright, <laughs> whatever works. You know what? Whatever works, man. Whatever's gonna... Gonna keep us both doing doing what we need to do. I'm a okay with that. So, I'm assuming that you know time works differently when you're frantically marathoning a game. And by the time I go in there, he'll have a full beard and have eaten literally everything in the house. So we'll have to we'll have to come back to that later. <laughs> we'll have to discuss whether or not that came to pass in the future. We just did Manga Pod, as I said. We did Co-Optional Podcast earlier today as well. Jesse wasn't there. Man, Jesse's been gone for two podcasts now. I was like, hey, come on. We don't even know what he's doing. He was just like, hey, I gotta be out of town for a couple of days for a thingy. We were like, boo. But it was fine because we have to have both of the Unit Lost guys on there. And last time they were on, I don't think I was on that one. But last time they were on, it was like the both of them in the same screen. <laughs> it was like super awkward. So this time they got their own screens. They got to be contributing members of the Co-Optional Podcast Society. So that was good. We had good discussions. I felt very energetic today for the most part. So that's always good on podcast days because you sit for so long, you know? So yeah, Co-Optional went well. Um, Manga Pod went really well. We were talking about Blackjack. And again, I talked about Blackjack yesterday, but... It was interesting because I wasn't sure whether or not to expect that all of us would feel the same. Because like I said, the aesthetic was super weird for me. I didn't like the artwork combined with the sort of subject matter. So um, 
for me it didn't it didn't really hit the mark so I gave it a low score but both of the boys Daza and Yoku really liked it they thought it was great so we were like okay I always like those manga pods where we don't all like mostly agree you know but I found out did not know this so when I said that I watched the blackjack anime um, I was apparently I was referring to the OVA that was made in 1993 they made like a full normal anime in 2004 did not know that and that's all on Crunchyroll so I was like oh man I gotta go and watch some Crunchyroll some Crunchyroll some Crunchyroll I love Crunchyroll so much. It's A plus, best. I love having it on the iPad and just laying in bed and being like, anime. <laughs> or taking it to the gym when you're on the treadmill or on the elliptical, you can just write anime. It's good. It's good times. <laughs> oh no, now I'm like blue again. Have I looked this way the whole time? Did something change? Let's see if we can make me like a weird color. I'm just, oops, nope, that didn't work. I tried to just type in red and it took me to reddit. That's not what I want. I want the color red. Red color. View page. No. We need to make you bigger. We need to make you better, faster, stronger. Zoom. Zoom. <laughs> Mood lighting. So yeah. <laughs> That's a sort of mood I'm in right now, if you couldn't quite tell. Mm. I don't know what I'm going to do for the rest of the night. Well, I'm going to edit. I have stuff that I still need to edit, so... <sighs> I'm going to be doing that. And uh, I'm really excited because I think tomorrow I can start playing How to Full Boyfriend. going to be good. I'm so excited to play that. So many people have been like, it's been out for a long time. I don't know why you didn't just play it before. Somehow I've managed to like not know the story of Hot to Full Boyfriend at all. I've like, I know it's pigeons and that's all I know, which is perfect. I've like made a point of not watching anyone play it, of not playing the like cracked version myself. I just waited until the English version like officially came out and so now I can finally play it. Everybody's been like, I miss your dating sims, you should play more dating sims. So guess what? We're gonna play a dating sim about pigeons. <laughs> and I want to get all the endings. Not many people have enough patience to get all the endings, but man, I want to get all the endings. <laughs> we never got all the endings in Magical Diary. We only played through that once. But I feel like, I feel like we got the purest love, you know? We got a, a sweet, a sweet, pure love. But man, I was so bad at the magic part of Magical Diary. <laughs> I always got so excited, like, for the actual magic tests, but I did so badly at them. There were a couple where I, like, nailed it, and then the rest of them, man, I did so bad. What are you doing? What's happening? Oh. I think there's like, there's like one of those spiders that's like this big down there. She's like oh. <laughs> doing that, doing that sort of thing. Like cats do, you know. Oh, she got it. I'm going to eat it. <laughs> I'll leave her to it. Anywho, uh, yeah, I'm going to go and edit, but I hope you guys have had an amazing day and I will talk to you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.